Hey everyone, it's JT from Work It Daily. Today I want to give you a simple trick, a little hack that you can use um, when you don't have any experience and you need a job. All right. So the challenge with that is that if you apply to jobs and you don't have any experience, they're going to see your resume, they're going to see you don't have any experience, and they're going to toss you. They're not going to call you. And it's probably happening to you now if you're watching this video. So what's the workaround? Well, the solution is for you to have conversations with people instead of showing them your resume first. Because we know for a fact, we study this, that hiring managers hire on personality first, aptitude second, and experience third, and in that order. So they got to like you. They've got to feel connected to you. They got to feel like, oh, you're somebody I could work with. Then they have to feel like you have the aptitude, the ability to adapt and learn on the job. And lastly, if you have the experience, great, because it means you can hit the ground running faster. But there's been plenty of instances where companies have hired somebody with a lot of experience, but they've had a lousy personality, and they're very inflexible and not adaptable, and they don't win. So companies know that, and you need to know that. So what's the solution? Get out there and have conversations with people. You need to find a bucket list of companies that you would love to work for, and then you need to start to talk to people who you know work there, who know people who work there. You're not going to ask them for a job, don't worry. You just want to say, hey, I admire that company. I want to learn more about what they think it takes to earn a job there someday. I don't have the experience yet. I know that I can't apply there, but I would like to hear what they think it'll take someday to earn a job there. It takes all the pressure off, right? You're not asking for any favors. You're not asking them for a job. You're asking to learn what it would take to get a job there. But here's the really crazy cool part. When this happens and you have a conversation with somebody, they get to see your personality. They get to see your enthusiasm. You get to express why you care about the company, why you like it. They get to see that you're trying to figure this out for yourself and taking initiative. And a lot of times they'll say, well, let me introduce you to somebody in the company for when you're ready to to apply or you know maybe I know a hiring manager you can talk to somebody else the more people that you talk to in that company who get to know you the easier it is for them to then say well you know he or she was pretty cool and you know they may not have the experience but after talking to her and him I, I feel like they would get the hang of it that's how you get hired when you don't have experience and it happens all the time folks and it's really kind of a lot of fun because you're talking to people you're getting to know about their company you're getting to learn how they got their job and in turn you're learning a lot of information about the company so when you do get an interview finally you know what to say okay so the fancy term for this is called informational interviewing but informational interviewing this idea of reaching out when you don't have any experience it's absolutely the way to go and you'll be amazed at how much easier it'll be to talk to people and at the same time, eventually get hired there, okay? All right, try it for yourself, and we wish you good luck.